Nicholas Robert DeFazio. The summer of 2014 changed my life forever. I've never experienced such an instant connection like ours. We spoke for hours and hours about our passions and fears, and shortly after jumped in a pool fully clothed just because the mood struck. Love is a bird. It ain't a thing. It's not something you hold. It's not something you scream. I remember smiling the entire way home as pool water got all over my parents' car. I prayed for you that night and stayed awake, tossing and turning, wondering what God had in store for us. And here we are, six years later, committed to forever. I've always admired your positive outlook on life, the way you make everything more fun, and how you handle the things with ease. I'm so thankful that God gave me not just a sister, but a friend to count on no matter what. I am blessed that you have dedicated this day to change your world and become a DeFazio. In return, I vow to dedicate myself to you, loving you endlessly for all the days the Lord has set out for us. You have been a part of this family for a long time now. You have dropped everything to hang out every single time we visit home. You have been so intentional about being in our family, and you've officially taken Dad's title away as the best at Mario Kart. And I know for sure because of you, our family is vastly different and has affected how all of us live in such a positive way. You make everyone in the room feel seen and loved. You genuinely enjoy every moment in life. And I'm honored to have you as my brother. I couldn't have prayed for anything more than to see the person I've cared for my entire life. Be loved by one of the most thoughtful and caring men I know. You complete our family in the best way. Behind every great man is a, is a driving force that keeps him strong when he needs strength and love when he needs to be loved. And uh, never would I have guessed the girl that I walked the halls with Kings with would be my sister-in-law. There are so many things that led me to fall in love with you. It was your infectious love of life, your beautiful smile, the way you pushed me to be better, the way you make me laugh every day, and most importantly, the way you dedicate yourself to loving everyone you meet like Jesus loves. Um, I actually got to witness the first moment of Rachel and Nick falling for each other. We were hanging out at a friend's house, and while everyone mingled, the two of them sat by the fire pit for hours. In the morning when I wake I remember getting in the car and Rachel could not stop smiling the entire drive home. And since that night, I have seen them go from high schoolers crushing on each other to doing long distance in college and now sitting here today, married. Shall I write it in a letter? I finally met him and boy, I could not have picked out a better match for my best friend. Thank you, Nick, for taking care of my best friend. For being so fun loving. For being the greatest sister. The greatest servant of heart in all that you do. And for literally tearing up any dance floor you step on. Can I be close to you? Every one of us has gone through at least a bit of hardship. And there's one thing you can always count on and it's that Nick will be the person by your side to get you through it. And honestly, I didn't think I'd really meet anybody else that quite shared that, that same level of personality. And then I met Rachel. She's there for the good and the bad, she's by his side. She's steadfast, faithful, and everything that you could ever want in a life partner. And I promise to continue to stand with you every moment of your life as long as you let me. It's an honor to be called your bridesmaid, but it's an even bigger honor to be called your friend. Your 
you're stunning, you're endearing, you're thoughtful, you're so gorgeous. Your complexity excites me every time that we talk. Um, there's just something about you, there's a sparkle to you, there's there's this joy that radiates off you that I, I can't express. It's intoxicating and I love every time and every moment that we spend together. I promise to not let circumstances determine the joy in our life. I promise to be your biggest supporter and always have your back. I promise to keep life fun and our days filled with joy and laughter. I promise to continually point you back to Jesus when life doesn't go as planned. Nick, I take you as my husband to have and to hold, for better or worse, for the rest of our lives. You are my one and only today and every day. I love you. I now pronounce you husband and wife. What God is doing together, let no man separate. Nicholas, you may kiss your bride. If I had to pick someone better for my brother, I would not be able to do it. So my original plan was to take the time to welcome you to the family, but being that it's been a year, you're pretty well versed in, in what you're getting into. I mean, you're locked in, you know. Uh, I'll just take the time instead to say that it has been a blessing to have you, and I consider myself very lucky to have another sister. Let's live our life. There's nothing more important to me than family, and I've always considered you as part of it. But I'm glad that today you're making that official and that is becoming a reality. You are intentional and have a huge heart like my dad. You are passionate and fun loving like my mom. You love selflessly and support me in a way like only my sister can. I could not have had a better couple to look up to in my life than you two. You guys have brought me so much joy. I'm so proud of you and all that you've accomplished this past year. From becoming a wife, scoring a wonderful new job, and from learning how to pump gas. But every day, I, uh, I thank God for Queen Rachel in my life. She's just been such an awesome sister to have, and I, I couldn't ask her a better sister in law. I love you both so much. So now let's raise our glasses to Mr. and Mrs. DeFazio. Nick and Rachel, may your days as husband and wife be filled with endless TikTok dances, the cutest of dogs, the most perfect couple selfies known to mankind. I wish you a life filled with happiness. You both deserve it. To Nick and Ray, 